morning. Oh, good morning. How are you? Just fine. Good. It's a lovely day. Oh, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I hope today's sermon is as good as last week's. I wasn't here last week. Was it good? Oh, yes. He talked about loving your neighbor and letting go of negative things and people, you know, just releasing them from your spirit. Mm, that sounds good. I'm sorry I missed that one. Oh, yes. And it was like he was talking directly to me. I've been holding on to so much since I lost my job six months ago. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. It's okay. Something has to come up. My unemployment's about to run out, but I know and I trust that God will provide for me. There has to be somebody that needs me, and I know I can be an asset to some children somewhere. Maybe I've just been looking in the wrong place. You work with children? Mm -hmm. I work for a Christian school. We're always looking for teachers and teachers' aides. I work in the administrative mm -hmm. department. Are you a teacher? I was a TA for children with special needs, but because of lack of funding, they had to cut back on all the TAs. The only ones they kept were the ones that were certified. We couldn't leave the nation's capital without getting some words of wisdom from the real experts on the subject. You know, people like you and me. And what better place to get the information that we needed than a beauty salon? So here we are on Capitol Hill in front of the home of Ian's studio. Let's go inside. Um, I think honesty, um, truth, um, responsibility, and um, achievement within the scope of my ability were the, were the things that were most stressed. Um, and, and I think the other thing is kind of funny, but I'll say it because it's important to me. My mother always said, boy, don't make me cry, and I haven't made my mama cry yet. 